Welcome back to Lily Clap Story. I'm Fire Nation and this is Project Zomboid. Alrighty everybody, thank you for joining me for another fantastic day with our girl Lily Clap. 8,667 zombies dispatched, which is surprising out of all those skulls that I've crushed. The hammer is my, my favorite weapon. 2,222 via fire and 29 via car. I just updated OBS because it repeatedly kept crashing every time I would go to record a video. So hopefully everything is good. You don't really know until you record a video and then find out something's wrong later on. Um, I've got food. What I wanted to do was go back to that area where we were looting across the way. I'm recording this after work, so I'm a little tired, but it's okay. Still gonna get a video in. OBS is one of those programs that like, it just breaks. It just yeets itself. I Like nothing's changed. I don't do anything to OBS. It might be because I haven't updated it in a year <laughs> since I've started uploading videos daily. But normally every time OBS updates, something breaks and I don't find out until I record later on, but it looks like everything's fine now. Hopefully nothing switched. I should have it set up to where I can just open it and run it and update it. Kind of like a, a foolproof plan. I am, <laughs> I am really tired. Okay, I don't get it. I get like four hours of sleep and I go to work and I get off and I feel great and I'm like, yeah, let's play some video games, do some laundry, and then I get like 10 hours of sleep because I'm exhausted from work and I get on to record and I'm like, oh my god, I'm dying. <laughs> it's not that bad though. And I'm not taking a day off. I am not missing an upload. No, zombies. Absolutely not. At least until the one year mark. That'd be, I believe, around May 13th. I'd have to check the dates. There's so many videos now. But, uh, I've got an ironclad resolution. Or no. Ironclad resolve to make it one year uploading every single day. So we didn't finish looting this building. And also, I think there were a couple other buildings near this that I wanted to check out. It just got too late for us last time. Okay, let me have a look at the map ski. Yeah, there's these. These, and then these are more stores. I really need to pause when I have the map open. You guys have warned me several times. And I'm usually pretty good about it. Except when I'm tired. When I'm tired, my brain just... The squirrel that controls my mind goes on break. Will you stop walking away from me? Yeah, you! <laughs> well, you gotta prolong the experience. Just get yeeted by the hammer of justice and be done with it. Yeah, nah. <laughs> nope, I just remembered real quick. Don't go near zombies when they're hopping over fences. Also, I want to welcome all the new subscribers. We are almost to a thousand, which is mind-blowing. Last I checked, we needed 19 more. There's an annotated map. Have a peek at that in a bit. Um, I never expected to even get this far. It still feels like I have 41 subscribers and I uploaded my first Project Zomboid video. Which my first 41 were basically online friends. And family. No real life friends. I I work a full time job and do YouTube. Do you honestly think I have real life friends? Because <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I don't care. Don't at me. I have acquaintances that I work with. But in all honesty, anybody that worked construction for the longest time and my whole time living where I do now uh, I've worked construction it started off seven days a week and I did that for about five years 
so I never really had time to make friends. And then even when I moved to like residential and commercial painting, which was arguably easier and less physical, arguably, uh, you just don't want to do crap. Like the only thing you want to do is plant your butt in the couch and watch some TV. You want to deal with nothing. And the same thing applies when you go on a big loot room or loot run in this game. And you get back home and it's late and you spent more time out than you thought you were going to and uh you just click transfer all into a crate and hope it goes away <laughs> that's basically what it's like to get off work when you work construction i don't know if there's anything in here that's worth it maybe i mean we did find a firearm lock up in a bank so stranger things have happened there is no door there I don't want to go too far away from home in case it gets crazy with the storms and stuff again. I don't want to be dealing with that. How do you get into that? Oh, I see. This is like a showroom. Yeah, like a showroom door. All right, well, we're going to take the Shoelace Express down to these couple black dots on the map. Over mirror. It's a lot of good looking vehicles, too. I wonder... There might be like a Electromax van in there or something. And if there is, they usually have tools. Get out of here. Get. Get. Also, I just haven't had time to record the RimWorld videos. It actually did surprisingly well for introducing a new game to the channel. I think before that, all I really did was Phasmophobia. And then Resident Evil 7 and Dark Souls. Nobody watched the Resident Evil, uh, not 7, 4 remake. Nobody watched those videos, so. I right, got to the, uh, chopping block. It's a great game, and I was having fun with it, so it, you know, a bit sad. All right. Ooh, is that a prisoner or a worker? Get out of here. Get. Do I have panic? No. At least not yet. When I get to the bigger groups, I start getting panic. Um, yeah, take those. All right. There's enough of them now where I'm going to get to work and speed this up for you guys. And I'll reconvene with you. Also, it helps me concentrate on the fight and keeping Lily alive. Alrighty, everybody. Welcome back. So, I think I pretty much cleared this area out. At least enough to loot some of these cars. A lot of these look like they're in great condition as well. So I'm going to... Wow. Another annotated map. Uh, I'm going to mark this on the map. On the map. On the map. We got two annotated maps to read. So let's uh, try to remember how to do that. Let's read this one. West Point. Okay. Safest egress. Likely attacks. Fence, then south across the road to the forest. Chances of survival, one month, 58%. Through winter, 22%. Eat more food in a working car. Okay. That's over by the school, I think. All right. And then um, they stack. Which one do I know with how I read it? Okay, this one's for March Ridge, the hellhole. <laughs> it's quiet here. Medical center, don't use guns, stuff you can use as weapons here. Okay. Both places kind of death traps, but good to know. Some more duct tape and a sack, a dirt bag. Thank you. <laughs> Where are my dirt bags at? Oh, and a lighter. Good, good, good. Okay. Yeah, th both of these look like they're in almost mint condition. This one's locked, so I assume the other side's locked. So, let me smash. 
Use the hot swap. Z key, some Siggies. Take the matches. Unlock the trunk. Scratch my nose. Uh, more duct tape. Did I get that? Yeah, I did. This might have tools in it. Sometimes they do. Has a flare gun, garbage bag, and a tarp. Okay. Uh, some twine for traps. There is a key in it. I guess I'll take it. Why not? Double layer step van key. Alright. What do you got, little blue? Locked. So, let me smash. E. Z. One. There we go. Some ciggies. Some twine. Moldra map, alcohol wipes. I've got so many alcohol wipes. Another dirt bag. Good. I checked most of the zombies. I did find this zip gun. Had a little bit of ammo. Not much else on them, unfortunately. Here, zombie, get out of the car immediately. The last thing you want to get... Last thing you want to happen to you is get stuck in a car. Awful way to go. Awful, awful. Especially when the zombies are on fire. <laughs> Quite the show, but it really sucks. I've had one heck of a headache all night. Man, everybody's got dirt bags here. This is Dirt Bag Central. <laughs> and duct tape. Duct tape and dirt bags. Sounds like a garage band. He's got a hatchet. One of those zombies up there. Getting a little off base from where we originally wanted to go. Okay. Nothing in there. We're still heading over to these. I don't know what they are. They're awfully small, but... Yeah, these little sheds here. I mean, we might be able to find something in them. I don't know. They have any loot containers or not. They just seem like little guard posts. Security guard posts. Get out of here, sir. <laughs> and the satisfying from them hitting the floor. It's always a good time. Maybe I should have left him on there to beat that down. I don't know, is this unlocked? No, it's locked. They might not have... Oh, they could... They do have windows, good. And there is a zombie in there. I thought I heard one. Looks like there's a register in there and maybe a cabinet. God. I really need to shower. I feel like... The salt flats. I was hauling some major A tonight. Tonight. Today? Today night. I feel bad because I do have to leave after my eight hours is up. But. I try to make up for that by going as fast as I can. All night. Wow. That's a lot of zombies. Okay. Is there anything else worthwhile in this parking lot? If not, I might just get out of here. I can always hop the fence. I just want to see if there's a work van or something up here. Ooh. It's not a work van, but it is a good van. Got my eye! Alright. I'm gonna make my way home, and I'll reconvene with you guys tomorrow. Unless it gets crazy, and then I'll bring you back. Be right back, sweat. Well, that didn't take long. I got all those behind me, and then these guys were conveniently sitting at my car waiting for me. Might pull the machete out, try and get some skill with that. You need to be careful with it. Swing speed isn't quite what a hammer's is. Oh, jeez. There we go. There we go. Come on, yeah. Come on. Conga line. Yeah. Keep getting those one shots. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of you. Come here. Arrgh. Look at all that tomato paste everywhere. Get out of here. 
¿Qué? ¿Qué? <laughs> oh, my brain hurt. My brain hurt. Okay. Well, let's check if there's any loot on him. Um, uh, not really. Some ciggies. That, that's another thing I have a lot of. All right. I'll reconvene with you guys tomorrow. Good morning, survivors. It is now the next day. Six months, four days, 14 hours. We're doing good. Um, got cold, so I put a sweater on. But let me just make sure I have a little bit of food. My weapon situation looks pretty good. I might bring this extra machete. I've got food in my car. What I wanted to do is go down to that area that we hopped the fence over on the other side of the train tracks. If it's not storming. Yeah, I've got food and stuff in the trunk of this bad boy. I put some more gas into it. We were getting low. Oh, yeah, look at that. Four beef jerkies, some choco cakes. Oh, we're set for the day. It's actually fairly cold in that game, too. And I wanted to get over there and just loot some houses. We went through a lot of the garages, almost all of them. I think I missed a couple that somebody had told me. Be very careful with this. Let me get a weapon out. Yeah, <laughs> I thought so. It's been a while since I've been over on this side. Whoop. Nope, get out of here. Yeah, we looted pretty much all the garages, um, but not the houses. And you often find good loot inside houses, not to mention food and other things like that and books. I think we still need one hunter magazine. Okay, I'm going to speed this drive up to our safe house and then we'll get on the, the road. All right. We have made it back, or not back, but to our safe house. I hit those microwaves again. <laughs> it's like a magnet to those things. Uh, I'm not going to really go in. I might spend the night in this place, just for old times sake. But we need to not get hit. You absolute mongoloids. I heard them after I press the E key to hop over the fence. And I was like, oh no. But thankfully, we had a second before we got grabbed. <laughs> that could have been real bad. Always listen before you jump over fences. More often than not, you'll hear the zombies if, the, if they're there. I'm guessing some of them followed, it, followed us up the last time we were here. Might want to turn that off. These guys didn't even notice. Hey, you noticed that? Oh, we hit me in the head. <laughs> was that a bee that stung me? No, it was the hammer of justice. Man, this area. I have cleared this place out so many times. And there are just always zombies here. Right in the side of the mouth. <laughs> that guy got scalped too. What's with who's scalping zombies in the apocalypse? I want to know. Kind of want them on my side. Good night. <laughs> Walked up like he was going to do something and got knocked out. Boy. You know what's. I was driving down to the safe house and I was trying to do like some Tokyo drifts, but uh, surprisingly with the snow, you still have full traction. And my dream of doing donuts is fading fast. Thought I might be able to get away with it in the snow. All right. All right, fine. Go back into your house. What is this, man? Every time I come over here, where are you guys all coming from? God dang! Just zombie land up in here. They all congregate. They're out here singing Kumbaya. 
smoking them jank rolls. Get out of here. You were not the zombie that went into that house. Hold on. Let me check my map. Where am I? Okay, so I have been through some of these houses, but not all of them. That's good. That's good to know. And I usually will leave the door open to let myself know you've been through here. Wow. What are you guys doing? What's going on over here? Cook out. Huh? That was very careful. Or it's, that was very close. I need to be careful. Always watch your back. Otherwise, the zombies will. And they're not too friendly about it. There's a peanut butter sang and a chocolate bar up in there, bro. Get out of that house. Yeah, you. Get. Also, the trees in this area now do not help. Where's that duffel bag? Uncomfortable wind chill. Give me that chocolate bar. Hell yeah, I'm taking the chocolate bar. It's the apocalypse. Yeah, you were the zombie. Let me just close that. Bam! <laughs> Insert some glass shards into your face. Oh, it took her a minute to recover, too. Ah, I gotta sneeze. <coughs> okay. I think I just blew my back out. Oh, that really hurt. <laughs> I sneezed and, like, my spine was just like, what are you doing? Oh, my God. I think we're good. My allergies lately... There's a gun pouch on this guy. My allergies lately have just been relentless. Pair of ordnance, P14-1911. I'll take it. I think I've got one of those. But only one. It's good to have backups. God knows... Stop! Why you bother me so bad? Should probably... Oh, that's chain mail. Oh. Oh. You guys have been telling me about the chain mail for a while. The boots are good. These. I'll take them. I'll take them. Why not? Add them to my wardrobe. Oh, I forgot to show you guys my trophy collection. All the heads that I've collected. Spiffo heads, Robbie the Rabbit heads. They're all on my table. I can't wait for spring to spring. That way I can turn the generator on Start growing crops. And now I have to worry about getting snowed in. I'll take that metal bar. Might need it. I might need it. Alright. I was gonna say. I was just about to say. I think we're good enough to go into some of these houses. The zombies had other ideas. Yeah, I knew, I knew I saw another one. These trees give the zombies such an advantage, and I hate it. Get out of there. Yeah, you. Get out of there. Just would like to get in and loot some houses. Not just make videos on fighting zombies. Come here. Hey. There is so much rustling going on. I have no idea if you guys can hear it or not, but... Making me jumpy. I don't know what's a zombie rustling in a tree or the wind. Alright, fine. Just break it. Let me smash. 
I know I heard something. Yeah, yeah. You was coming to get me, weren't you? Yeah. No. Absolutely not, sir. Man. Get out of here. Dak gone rap scallions. No broken glass here, right? Okay. Good. Unless I get a splinter in the butt going through that window. How many of you are over there? There's a zombie so somewhere over there inside one of these houses. There you go. Are you happy you crossed all those fences to get to me? I'm gonna bust out my flashlight because it is rather dark. Okay. Before we start looting, let's clear the house of any unwanted guests. There we go. Close that. Hopefully nothing else sees me. Or hears me. Or smells me. Because we haven't had a shower in six months. I'm pretty sure we're smelling right. Okay, it's this door. Wow! Yeah, yeah, I thought you were going to get the jump on me, did you? No! Got the jump on you. Okay, that door's not in here. Oh, 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 oh. I thought that was a magazine we didn't have. Forging four, though. I think I have that. Nothing in there. Ooh. 44 mag rounds. I think that's the first gun case I've found in this run. What do we got in here? Yeah, sleeping tablets. Always check the countertops when you're in bathrooms, too. And kitchens, because they usually have... What is going on down there? Shut up! They usually have stuff. Countertops, that is. Extra battery. Take that. Okay. Denim hot pants. Whew. Some Daisy Dukes up in cheer brick. Take that thread. Eh, the vitamins, why not? 1 p.m. As long as there's not a million zombies, we probably have time to do a house or two. More sleeping tablets. I don't need any more vitamins. I really don't. Fishing four. Shut the hell up. Ooh, mac and cheese. Crackers. <laughs> close, close the door. Okay. Tuna. I did need some more canned goods, so this is a good thing to come over here. Probably turn my flashlight out too. Any secret right here? These little pulled up planks in the floors, sometimes I found my first one in this run. Sometimes you'll find a loot stash in those. So keep your eyes banana peeled. Good night, sir. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Some beta blockers, huh? Huh? I see that tree shrinking. Ah! I thought it was one, but there was. They're multiplying. Oh, God. They're multiplying. Hermaphrodite zombies. Herm <laughs> Hermaphrodites. <laughs> I was trying to think of a joke to go with that, but I. I'm too stupid. I'm just gonna say it. 
Ah, uh, I wish I had. Exposure Survival 4, I'll take that. I wish I had a good vocabulary. And I could make actual jokes and not just rely on noises and and fart sound clips. <laughs> uh, I know, okay? I know the channel's lowbrow comedy. I'm not denying it. Somebody had fun. Um, <laughs> speaking of lowbrow, I'm not denying it. Nothing in there. Bookshelf? Uh, no. Ooh, big wardrobe. Come on, show me the money. Nah, nothing. Let's have a cigarette real quick. Ooh, there's something close to me. A zombie. Also, I'm dying from my allergies right now. I don't know if you can tell, but yeah. Dying. My eyes are all itchy. Uh, half good hammer. Some more ropes. Full battery. Take that. Does he put it back in? Oh, good. Yeah, I like that. I don't know when they added that to the game, but I really appreciate it. Uh, no, we just had one. Uh, your character adding things back to where they got them, like you look at the can opener. That is a huge time saver. Annex 3, I'll take that. Long gone are the days of having to put the can opener back in your selected bag. Antibiotics on the countertop. Keep putting things into my backpack. I mean to put them in the... Keep putting things in my inventory and I mean to put them in the backpack. God, I can't talk right now. My eyes are all itchy. My nose is all scratchy. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I should be marking these off too while I'm looting them. Making all kinds of mistakes. This is rookie hour. Okay. I don't know where they're at, but I hear something like right here. Yeah, <laughs> you can't fool the seven point sound, seven point one surround sound headset. I know where you guys are at most of the time. Okay, I've looted these three. Well, I don't, I don't know about this one. It's been broken down. Have a look, ski. I don't feel like I've been in here. Low descent, first aid three. Hey, the back door is still intact. That's good. And the window back there. No, I definitely have not been in here. Why do I keep doing that? I like almost always take the can corned beef hash and tuna. Because they're light and they're good. I did need some more condiments for back at home. For cooking. So, it's good. It's good. Very nice. Alright. Let's check upstairs. Forging four again. Nice big wardrobe. With nothing. Some more sleeping tablets. Take those. Nothing. Somebody left their used comb. I can hear the... Yeah, there's definitely... Okay, no. They're next door. The zombie's like right here.
That is eerie. Electrical five, trapping four. Okay. I check you? Yeah. All right. Pause the game. Even though there's still stuff in here that's useful, I'm going to mark it with an X because I've been through here and I've seen pretty much anything that's worthwhile for me right now. Wow. Okay. Yeah, it's starting to get late. And I'm going to head back home. You know what? I don't want to jump over that fence again and have zombies be in there. So I'm going to take these guys out and get back to the safe house. But I'll speed that up for you guys. Alrighty, we have arrived back at our gigabase. Um, but I think that's enough for one episode. I know it's not that much content put into one video, but I'm very tired. I'm recording this post-working my eight hours. And uh, I always try to put at least two in-game days into, into a video worth of active playtime. That was the backseat. Uh, by default, which I'm on, the real life time um, is an hour per day. Get the hell out of here. I don't know where you were hiding, but get out of here. Yeah, it takes an hour in real life for a day to pass in the game. And you sleep through, I don't know what, like 20% of the day, maybe? Or I cut out 20% of the day for sleeping and sorting loot and yada yada. So roughly 40 minutes. So you can kind of calculate how long I spend making these videos <laughs> sometimes. It's a long time. All right, man. And I put the American flag outside of the door because it's America. It's a wrap. If you find yourself enjoying the content, leave a like and consider subscribing. You are one click away from joining the Fire Nation Army. And together we will rule the apocalypse of Knox County. If you're just finding this episode, go on back to episode one of the Louisville Trials. Right now it's Lily Clapp's time to shine, her time in the spotlight. The first few survivors died horribly. I am not at fault for that. Okay. 8,845 zombies dispatched via weapon. Favorite weapon is still the hammer. 2,222 via, via fire and 29 via car. Six months, five days. My longest ever survivor. And this is now my longest playlist on YouTube. It's crazy. Have a great day out there, all you beautiful people. I wish you a good day and the best of luck in your endeavors. And I will see you in the next one. And a big thank you to all the channel members. I can't say it more every video. You guys are awesome. I appreciate everything you do. Have a good one. Sram.